<laughs> you ever wonder what it's like to be a kicker? They practice differently, their body is different, their skill set is different. When compared to the rest of the football team, they stick out like the color blue in the town of Columbus. But kickers, at the end of the day, are really valuable. I went to Evanston to chat with one of the best in the league, the punter for the Wildcats, Hunter Nicewander. Okay, Hunter. Yes. You're a punter. Yes. Let's talk about it. Okay. Do you have a nickname? Uh, HTP, some people call me. What's that stand for? Hunter the punter, kind of goes. Why? Uh, my name's Hunter, and I punt, so Hunter the punter. I don't get it. No, yeah, some people don't. What about Hunter the kicker? Uh, you know, there was a time for that, you know, but that makes now a I'm a punter. Sense to me. Really? Yeah. Uh, I think that's just you. Clear this up for me. How disrespected are, are the kickers on the team? You know, on this team, I think we get treated pretty well. Um, we're always first in line for dinners and games, so that's a bonus. <laughs> Why are you first in line? Because uh, Coach Fitz loves a specialist. He eats with us, so yeah, I think he has a special appreciation for the specialist lifestyle. What sport are kickers best at besides football? Golf. That's an easy one. Why? I don't know what it is. You know, I think like the swing pattern along with like the kicking pattern, I think there's something to that, the hand-eye coordination. I think we got a natural gift at that. But wait a minute. The swing is mostly upper body. Yeah, yeah, but so you're like coming up and coming through the ball. Same thing with the kick, only at your leg. What do you do during practices? Oh, we get swole. We go to the weight room. <laughs> we lift. We get, get our kicks swole? in. We get our kicks in, hit the buys, tries, calves. Mm -hmm. Good to go. So everybody else is doing different formation, different positions, and you guys are just... Oh, that's our time to work. Yeah. yeah. After we're done working outside, we come in here, get going inside. How terrifying is a bad snap to you. Luckily, I don't have to worry about that a lot. Chris Fitzpatrick does a great job snapping the all ball. All right, all right, but, but still. I'm a pretty big guy, so it's hard to have a bad snap with me, I think, so yeah, I don't worry about that at all. But I imagine seeing, you know, if you gotta pick up a ball down low or it's up above you and you see the horde coming at you, mm -hmm. you're, just, you're just done. You just go with what you know to do and that's get the ball off as fast as you can. My first punt ever, actually, I punted with my left foot because I had to pick it up Saw the rush coming, and I put it with my left foot. So you get used to it, go with the flow. How far did it go? Oh, I don't remember. Probably not that far. <laughs> <laughs> How many games a year do you break a sweat? In the beginning of the year, probably every game. So it's just it's weather, hot. basically. Yeah, it's, it depends on the weather. Okay. It's over 60, I'm sweating. Do you have to get pedicures? No. That's, yeah, that's not me. So you yeah. just do them for fun, you don't have to? Nah, I'm more of a massage guy. Hmm. Yeah. Tell me about that. Loosen up the legs a little bit, get mm -hmm. the body right, get the mind right. Really, it's more mind than body. You just have that peace and quiet time. Don't have to worry about anything. Just relax. Is there anything I should know about what it's like being a punter? It's not as easy as you'd think. There's a lot of preparation that goes into it. A lot of, a lot of hard work, a lot of attention to detail. Are you just messing with me? It's really no, just dropping no, and that's, kicking. no, that's real. It's not dropping and kicking. They just, you know, got to worry about the wind. Got to be consistent. Got to stay loose. How many different types of punts are there? Okay, so we have zero. We have is, what's wait? What's a zero? Zero is just right down the pipe. Okay. Normal punt. Then you have punt to the right, punt to the left. Then you have rugby, Aussie, pooch, and, and lefty. If that, if you need that, <laughs> if, if it's you a end bad up need that, yeah. Which one do you like most? <sighs> zero. Yeah. <laughs> I can put it right down the pipe. Let's say, I know this would never happen to you, you have a bad punt. Yeah, okay. Maybe it gets blocked or you kick it low or it's it shanks. What is that feeling like walking off to the sideline? Usually the first thing I see is Coach Fitz and he's giving me that look like, you know, don't do that again. And uh, so usually I just go to the net and I'll start working on my punt, make sure that doesn't happen again. When you are on the sidelines and they call for a fake punt, Mm -hmm. Are you scared? Are you thrilled? Are you nervous? I'm pretty excited. That's my time to shine. You yeah. know, maybe be a quarterback. Maybe run a little bit. We'll see. Hasn't happened yet, but yeah. who knows? Has it not happened because you're not a good quarterback? You're not a good running back? You're not a good? <sighs> no comment. You know, that's between me and the coach. 